With the final touches coming together here in the Tucson Convention Center, the Ice Cats and the Tucson Roadrunners, a new AHL team, will have a new atmosphere come game time. The 29,000 square foot facility will be occupied by both teams during their seasons that begin in October and play all the way through April. To me, the players being able to see the preparation these guys put in uh, and how they carry themselves on a day-to-day, -day, um, you know, I'm hoping that rubs off on our guys a little bit. U of A hockey captain Dylan Carter says the upgrade came at the right time and now he is excited to see what the Roadrunners are going to bring to Tucson. The locker rooms are kind of run down. They, uh, you know, they were old and, you know, some water was seeping in, so it wasn't the best environment. For the Roadrunners and the Wildcats, new locker rooms and other renovations are in store for them. But even like this here, the press boxes that have been newly added to the 2CC bring a new atmosphere for game time come October. The $3.7 million renovation will have 30 stalls inside the locker rooms, new bathrooms as well as offices, and a weight room that the U of A hockey team will have access to as well. It's really a labor of love for these guys, and that's why being able to uh, get them a, a partnership with the, with the Roadrunners is so important. The goal is to build, build a hockey base in Tucson. The Roadrunners aren't Tucson's first NHL affiliate, but certainly help build the game of hockey here in Tucson. It's not necessarily a competition between the two of us as much as we can feed off each other and help grow the game of hockey. You know, the two programs have to work together and gain the respect of both Tucson fans. Both teams start their seasons in October and look to shine a brighter light on the hockey community here in Southern Arizona. For Arizona Cat's Eye, I'm Brandon Mejia.